This short video explains how you can use the form builder to create your own customized assessments. So let's get started and create a simple screening form. First, we'll name our form. Next, we'll choose a layout. You have two to choose from, a full width layout and a two column layout. As we're just starting, we'll choose the full width layout. Now, let's start adding some fields. At the top of the form, we'll probably want a heading, so let's go ahead and add that. Now we'll use a two column layout and add some fields side by side. First, we'll add a paragraph field on the left hand side. And now we'll add a couple of short text fields on the right hand side. At any point in the build, you can click on Preview to see how your form is looking. You'll also notice that your form is saved automatically as you're building it. Now we'll switch back to the left-hand column and add a multi-choice field with four choices relating to the 24-hour pattern of the condition. In your completed form, this will appear like a series of checkboxes. Then we'll add another multi-choice field on the right-hand side relating to history of present complaint. So far, we haven't used a single choice field, so let's add one in with a yes-no response. And we'll balance that up with an options list which will appear like a drop-down menu in the finished form. As we've reached a logical break in the form, we'll add a horizontal line and wrap the short example up with a large comments field. Let's finish up by taking a look at the form that we've just built by clicking on the preview button. Obviously, this example has been speeded up in places, but to give you an idea, this short form took about 10 minutes to build. Once you've finished building your form, it's automatically added to your favorites list in settings, assessments, and immediately usable by your team. Thanks very much for watching.